Shalom, and here's a thought for the week. There was a great, great Rebbe. He was the fourth Rebbe of the Chabad movement. His name is Reb, the Rebbe Maharash, Rabbi Shmuel. And this past Monday, we celebrated the second of the year, his birthday. And he was born on a day where we count the Omer, which is the 49 days when the Jews left Egypt, counting up to receiving the Torah at Mount Sinai on day 50. And he was born on the uh, day of the Omer, which was the 18th day of the Omer. And each day of the Omer carries a significance um, related to the seven emotive traits that we have, kindness, severity, compassion, endurance, bonding, humility, and leadership. And all seven traits have all seven within them. So there's kindness within kindness, severity within kindness. Each week we work on one of the seven attributes and refining ourselves every year after going out of Egypt during Passover to receive the Torah anew. So he was born on the day of compassion within compassion. Tiferes, Sheba Tiferes. In fact, when he was a little kid, he did well in school. And the teacher was so excited to tell his father he did very well, didn't he? And his father said, what you, could you expect? What would you expect? Tiferes, Sheba Tiferes. Compassion within compassion. But of course he's going to do well. And what he really had this statement that he would like to say was that people in the world, when they reach a problem in life, an obstacle, if they can't get under it, they try to go over it. But he says, I say... From the onset, you should jump over the problem. That means don't try to wiggle out of problems. Jump over it. And technically, practically, what that means is like this. You're facing a challenge in life. It could be a challenge from within, personal challenge inside of ourselves. We're dealing with our own, maybe, characteristics that we're not happy with, or addictions, or other depressed, sadness, and so on and so forth, anxieties, or having issues from someone else, social issues other from outside, work issues, or whatever it may be. Don't focus on what's wrong. Instead, add in doing what's right. That's the approach of jumping over problems. We're not going to look and start nitpicking that what I've done wrong, but try to enhance what you're doing right and do more of it and do more good deeds. Get When you're feeling down, get up and do something good. Help somebody put on tefillin, light the Shabbat candles, add in kosher tzedakah, helping oneself, uh, love your, especially love your fellow as yourself, do something to help someone else, and you'll find that the issues that you were concerned about dissipate, because a little bit of light chases away the darkness. So that's what it means. The world could say, don't get, if you can't get under, go over. I say, jump over the problem. Let's take that approach, and that's done with joy, and jumping, and happiness, and that's the approach of how we bring about the world peace by doing more good deeds with joy, and that should lead to Mashiach now. Amen. Have a wonderful Shabbat.